everybody, I'm Animal Boy, and today we are in Naples, Florida, visiting the Naples Zoo. This zoo is very fun. I heard they have lions, I heard they have honey badgers, and even Florida Panthers, my favorite animal. I'm so excited. How about you, Tazin? Oh, I can't wait, man. I love Florida Panthers. Same. Let's go. Ah! I envisioned that better in my head. My leg is stuck. Around here in Florida, you see a lot of local wildlife around exotic wildlife. And right here is one of those local animals, the white ibis. Yep. Yep. There she goes. Oh, she has a friend. There's two. Two white ibis. Would it be ibises or ibi? Ibi say 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 say. Ibi say say. Wow. Oh, I guess they're going. Have a good day. Goodbye, stork chickens. See you later, stork chickens. Oh my. Whoa. That is one big chunkin' gator right that there. The largest alligator is that big? That is big. Wow, that's either really big or you're really small. Probably both. True or false? If attacked by a black bear, fight back. Let's see the answer. I have no upper body strength. <laughs> you For me, not. it would just be run. Run like, run like the wind, man. Yes. Run like the wind. Those are some brave ibis, especially Why? since there's a big bear right there. Whoa. An American black bear, Ursus Americanus. Hey dude, hey bear. Hello. He's in contemplation. He's thinking, what if we could prevent forest fires? Is or what if only I could prevent right. forest fires? What if it was me all along and not them? Yes. Should he be hibernating this time of year? Well, he has a Christmas tree actually. He does. But no, black bears enter not full hibernation, but something called topor, which is basically them slowing down their heart rate um, I forget the actual difference, but I'll put it on the screen right now of the difference between hibernation and topor. I enter topor every afternoon between 10 a.m. and 3 p.m. I know, it makes scheduling meetings horrible. It's good topor though, man. It is good topor, I'll give you that. Good topor indeed. Would you look at that tapir right there? Whoa. Yeah. He's giant, man. Tapirs, are, they're some of the biggest land mammals of South America. They are the weirdest animals. Yeah. Would they you say they're like the elephants of this yeah, I'd say they're the closest, el well, closest looking elephants in the Western Hemisphere. Yeah. Closest to the elephants would be the manatee, who shares a cousin with them. Right, but this guy is, he looks kind of elephant-like, isn't he? Yeah, you can't really tell, but it's like a big fat pig with an elephant nose. Very cool. Mm -hmm. Love it. You it's know, I used to record some stuff on them. They called them VHS tape ears. Oh eh? my gosh. Taz, and you probably like these guys. They're very chill as well, wouldn't you say? I love capybaras, man. Yes, capybaras, the world's largest and friendliest rodent. They are so zen. Yeah, they're so zen that they hang around caimans and turtles and monkeys and birds. If you're ever down, do yourself a favor and Google capybara photos. You are sure to be happy. Hey, buddy, what's yeah. going on? I'm just This is the business dude. side of a capybara here, but this is the right front of a capybara. Are you kidding? Capybaras have no business. Their only business is Was chill. Was it something we said, man? No, they're going to spread their joy somewhere else because they've already blessed us with so much joy. That's they're just thinking point. of others. See you later, dudes. Bye, Abara. It was our pleasure. Cappy, bye, ya. Ah. Uh, oh, man. They said, where's the bear? The capybara here. I don't know which one was worse. Yeah, me neither. He's digging, man. The agouti is digging. Can you dig it? He's digging, where could, where, I guess Argentina is where you would dig to? Oh, and there's an anteater behind him, Tazin. Wow. Yes, the giant anteater, an animal that looks like it was made for the 70s. What an odd couple to live together. Oh, well, actually, they're quite peaceful. They eat different things, but giant anteaters, actually very dangerous. Those claws can rip through termite mounds like nobody's business. They are magical animals, man, magical to me. Yeah. Even though they do look like they're like covered with 70s shag carpeting. Mm -hmm. And their hands look like pandas. 
Really? Yes. If he comes by, you can see the pandanus of their hands. The pandanus. He's vanished. That's another thing they have the power to do. They that, can turn invisible at will. That I did not know. Like this. I'm really close to you. Oh, you're gone. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> this would be a bad time to find out if I'm Harry Potter or not. <laughs> Someone put googly eyes on the panther uh, like picture. That's pretty hilarious. And man. you are my hero. Whoever did that, that's awesome. Okay, this right here is my favorite animal. This is the Florida panther. Oh man. I trust she was just walking by here just as oh she's coming back around. This one's name is Athena and she is amazing. Her and Cypress used to be good friends. Oh, right there there now, she is. She? Yep, there you go. There is the Florida panther, the most endangered big cat, or the most endangered cat of North America. Are there two Florida panthers in there? I don't know. All I know is Athena. Isn't that one there? Tazin, that's a tree. So what's Athena's story? According to this, her mother had moved on and forgotten about her, and they tried to reunite the two, but they were unfruitful. So she now lives at Zoo. Yet another type of mountain lion that was saved by zoos. Watch that video we just did. That's true. Yeah. We talked about the mountain lions at the Oakland Zoo. Yeah. But now this is the panther at the Naples Zoo. Excellent. And what's the difference between panther and mountain lion? Uh, there's a few ones. Well, a mountain lion is a, a panther is a mountain lion, but a mountain lion is not a panther. It's an on and off subspecies. Taxonomy is wild. But some main differences are obviously found in Florida. Longer ears, longer legs, a cowlick, and a crooked tail. Got it. Does look a lot like Cypress, man. It really does. Hello, Athena. It's so good to see you again. I haven't seen you for a bit. So cool. Hi, Athena. Hi, Athena. What's going on, bud? Oh. Hey, there she uh, is. Athena. What a majestic cat. Yeah. I love panthers so much. Yeah, which is why you need to protect them. Support Path of the Panther and Florida Wildlife Corridor, please. Right. Where habitat's being destroyed and they need places to move. Absolutely. And drive slowly on the highway. Definitely. So, Tazin, when you have drum circles, do you invite this fine gentleman? Yeah, I like to play the bongos. <laughs> That's a bongo antelope, in case anyone was wondering. Yeah. That's a very deep zoology pun to get that joke. Very deep. Yes. You know, I come to this bench every day. How about you? Guess not. Look at that, guys. There's wild parakeets. I'm pretty sure these conures are invasive to Florida, but it's still cool to see them wild. Wow, check that out. Yeah. That's not part of the zoo. Nope, that's just wild. That's what Florida does. You go to the zoo, you get bonus animals. Florida is like a zoo, and they build little zoos inside the Florida Zoo. Well, hopefully that other lion is okay. Yep. But hey, there's buddy. a lion right there. How you doing? She's looking right at us. Oh. You ain't lying. I'm kind of scared. She's up. What is, what is her plan? We well, you know the big cats see you as prey, right? I remember the cougars at Elmwood. Yes, Absolutely. Um, she disappeared, but I'm sure it's gonna be fine. Like, oh, look, her, her her husband's over there. Check him out. Oh, there he is! Wow, big old mane on that fella. He's the main man. Yep. Ah, uh, such a lovely day. I hope nothing will badger me. Oh, come on! This is one of the only zoos in America with honey badgers. They don't seem to care about us being here, though. Hey, honey. You know these? Well, I guess honey badgers and Tasmanian devils are somewhat alike. Well, like honey badger Cheerios, you know? They're oh, yes. delicious. Well, they don't taste like badger. They taste like honey. <laughs> I don't think they taste like badger. I really don't know Have what badger tastes like. Have you ever tasted a badger? Like. I really don't. I wow, don't they are schmoovin' right now. 
going back and forth in fun little circles. Circles, fun for the whole family. So back there is the hyena. And then the cheetah is walking in the opposite direction. Yeah, so it's right like, there. okay, you take the left, I'll take the right. Are these but, animals found in the same place? Uh, I know they're both found in Africa. I believe hyenas are, or striped hyenas are found in the same place as cheetahs, but I'm not 100% positive. But I'm like 88.95, 67% sure. So when they play soccer or basketball against each other, it's like... It's spots versus stripes. Absolutely. Wow. That's one funny looking serval right there. There's a duck. Or is that a green? Oh, where's the duck? He ducked. Duck gone. I think it was a grieb actually, but who cares? That's a funny joke. I like it. Hmm. I'm surprised they didn't sponsor the tapir exhibit. Baird's tapir is a type of tapir. Oh, gotcha. Eh. You know, three people chuckled there, and that, those three, thank you. Deep cuts, man, deep cuts. And everyone else should subscribe. Yes, they should. You know, they really know how to stick their neck out there. Oh my goodness. Which draft is tallest? Hmm. If I had to say, I would say it's the one on the far right, maybe, yep. or far left. One yep. of those two is the tallest. I think you're right. The others are all short. Yep, that's a very short giraffe right there. Are you drinking the best coffee? Yes, and you can't have any. So, Tazin, what was your favorite animal here today at the Naples Zoo? I think I like the tapir. Ooh, tapir's a good one. I thought you were gonna say capybara, strangely enough. I love the capybaras, of course, but tapir, I don't see tapirs all the time, so that was pretty cool. Indeed. I think it's obvious what mine was. I got to see Athena, the Florida panther. You went nose to nose with Athena again. Indeed. Again? Well, yeah, you guys have a history. Have a good day, and remember, folks, it's a sign from above. See ya!